Here's a short overview of some of the innovative new features in the sail timer wind instrument. First, it's pretty unusual to have an anemometer that you can simply move around in mid-air while viewing the wind direction and wind speed. There's a digital compass right in the tail of the wind direction arrow. The compass actually has a built-in 3D motion sensor to help it maintain the same wind direction even when the boat is heeled over since traditional compasses don't work well when tilted over. Since you don't need to calibrate it to the bow of the boat when it's installed, that also means it's well suited to rotating masts. And because it's wireless, you can raise it from deck level on a halyard. That makes it easy to install. There are no wires to install down the mast and through the cabin. It knows which way it's pointing, even in midair. The jewel bearings in the new wind instrument also mean that there is no friction at all in the wind cups and in the wind direction arrow. Watch what happens when we give one push to the tail on the new wind instrument on the right and on a standard anemometer on the left. The standard anemometer has grease in ball bearings and needs to be pushed repeatedly. The grease adds drag and cannot get wet or be submersed. But the wind direction arrow on the right turns freely. It just keeps on going. The wind cups are the same way in this new design. They also use jewel bearings, the same as in a watch mechanism, and have no friction at all. This is also the first anemometer designed for boats of all sizes. From keel boats to small centerboard sailboats that could flip.